Welcome everyone, you are watching Hudson County TV. I'm Fernando Uribe, reporting from the West New York Middle School as I bring you highlights from the Back to School Health Fair. Various vendors converged upon the West New York Middle School to bring awareness, but more importantly, give parents and children an idea of what healthy living and a healthy lifestyle is all about. Prevent Child Abuse New Jersey is a nonprofit organization that has programs statewide. We provide different services to families and children. Our mission is to prevent child abuse in all of its forms for all of New Jersey's children. Now, again, for our viewers that aren't familiar with Prevent Child Abuse New Jersey, a little more information, whether it's a website or a, even a hotline that can help parents and even children struggling with abuse. Yes, our website is www.preventchildabusenj.org. We have a lot of different information on there, including tips for parents and other resources that are accessible on our website. And our phone number is 1-800-CHILDREN, and you can call that hotline to for more information. We look to um, promote healthy families through prenatal through age three. Um, through helping families understand healthy child development, family well-being, and healthy parent-child interaction in preparation um, for school. The obstacles we tend to encounter are families that don't necessarily understand the services and um, benefits that are available to them, particularly our bilingual families. Um, we are a grant-funded program throughout the state of New Jersey, and people um, are a little uncomfortable with home visitation until they really understand that we um, really work to promote healthy families um, away from um, governmental intervention. Well, we like to service all our patients within our community, especially, of course, West New York, uh, who's a very big advocate, of course, of Palisades Medical Center, and our outreach community programs, which, of course, caters to all the uh, areas. What's the most complicated aspect of, of your position, especially in your department, with patient relations? With patient relations, I think it's more make, meeting the needs of the patient. <coughs> we want to make sure that everybody is happy um, and that all their needs are satisfied, uh, both in quality and in safety within our hospital standards. Okay. Well, again, Ms. Medeiros, you're doing great work. Uh, thank you for coming out today and really providing this invaluable service for residents. Thank you again. Thank you very much for having us. I had a chance to speak with West New York Commissioner Frida Lisa Frias as to what makes this event so worthwhile and significant, not just for children, but for parents as the school year is quickly approaching. This, these events are particularly extremely important due to the fact that we are about to start school one more time and we have backpacks available for the children as well as four different types of vaccinations. So this particular one we decided to do it right before school started for that particular reason. Um, amongst our residents there are some that do not have uh, capabilities of having uh, health insurance. Therefore, we can provide them with screenings uh, for cholesterol, uh, glaucoma, uh, skin cancer, uh, and many other services for, for no cost whatsoever. So it's just another way for Western New York to prepare for its upcoming school year and also preventing disease. Prevention is the best medicine. It's not after the fact that you should run around and get medicine, but there's many illnesses that can be prevented, especially with proper exercise and proper nutrition. As you can see, it was a capacity crowd that came here today in West New York to learn more about health, wellness, and more importantly, a healthy lifestyle on a daily basis. Thank you so much for watching. For more programming, please go to HudsonCountyTV.com. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Twitter, and as always, stay classy, everyone.